hits me, uh, your old pal Mallers here. And um, so I recently found out, um, as of just now, that there is a, a trailer out for the 29th Godzilla movie. Um, obviously, this is a big deal. Apparently, it's been out since April 13th, so I'm a little slow on the uptake, but um, it's here. Um, so this is pretty exciting. So I'm going to go ahead and do one of these reaction videos. And um, th this is, your, you know what, I'll probably upload this as part of death anniversary. It's May 16th when I'm filming, May, May 6th when I'm filming this. So that's how you know, but it's enough talk. We're just going to react to it right now. So you can see that. All right. So here we go. Here's my reaction video. Big money and give me big money for doing reaction videos, guys. You did it for all those other fucking hacks. And here we go. <gasps> Holy shit. I'm okay. I'm okay. Oh my god. Was that what's his face? <laughs> my hands are numb. So that's happening. I really can't feel my right hand right now. <laughs> um. I'm fine. Breathing normally. This is great. Okay. Exactly how I wanted to enter the reaction video arena, but um, <laughs> it's real. So there, there's my reaction video to Godzilla not being dead, maybe. So. There he is. He's back, I guess. Maybe. I probably, maybe, maybe probably shouldn't post this. Maybe get, maybe it got a little bit too personal there for a little bit. But um, you know, there you go. I guess uh, make sure to like and subscribe and hit me up on 
Insta pals, I'm going to go cry myself to sleep now. I can't feel my right hand. Okay. So, um, there you go. There's going to be another Godzilla movie after all. Do your worst, Hollywood. Make another Geno if you want, I guess. And stop. 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 I said stop. Um, but I cut it off because I pressed the uh, stop button as I was saying it. So all you heard was, so then I finished the word. Yeah, you get it. Okay. Um, so that was me uh, reacting to the trailer. Um, and um, so if you... Uh, want to know what that intro card was all about uh this is deathiversary week and what that means is so the week before geno 2 came out i watched every godzilla movie in a row plus the cartoon plus one episode of zone fighter plus some commercials and such and such kittens you need to knock it off really i'm recording a thing you have to stop you probably can't even hear them so i don't know why i'm being so upset about it but um so that's what I did. So there was a week, and then on the 16th, I went and saw Geno 2, of course, because I had to. And then, uh, for some reason, I managed to survive that. So two years later, I'm still here, um, for some reason. And uh, so in 2015, I did the same thing, or at least I tried to, but I got the days all mixed up, so I didn't manage to get all the way to the end of it correctly. I only got through Destroya because I started late. And uh, so, but this year, I'm also doing it. And in the ninth to the fifteenth, the week before, I'm going through uh, all of them. But because I don't have to see it in theaters anymore, Geno Two, that is, uh, the eighth day is going to be more than just Geno Two. I'll probably watch Final Wars and Geno Two, maybe some others. But you don't have to worry about the schedule. I'll have to figure that out. So that's what's going on. So this is sort of like Day Zero, just reacting to the um, the new trailer even though um, I didn't record it on the 8th, I'm just uploading it on the 8th. So that's what's going on there. About the reaction, now that I've calmed down a little bit, I haven't see if I have any cohesive thoughts. I do. I'm kidding. Seriously, get away. These little monsters, I swear. Um, <laughs> But I'm um, one thing that really struck me as I watched, you know, I saw it again after um, after coming down a little bit, and I really like the tail, like the way it kind of drifts lazily around in the air, like a little streamer or something, and it kind of looks unreal, and I don't know if that's because. It's a practical thing that they painted over with CGI, or just a CGI thing that they attached to the back of the practical suit. See, that's what's fun when you use, like, uh, technology to its strength, you know? Where you can have real things that look real, but you can do things to them that you wouldn't be able to do in real life, right? Like, doesn't that make sense? Isn't that cool? Isn't that what you want? Um, but, you know, it, it's just... Hollywood hasn't figured that out yet. But, um, I think it's very cool because, you know, previously the height of what was possible was in Tokyo SOS, and, uh, that was that was mostly done not by augmenting the like the Mothra puppet itself, but with just the environment around her, like the way her wings waft through the clouds and shit was so cool. So um it looks very cool. I definitely dig the spooky spooks Godzilla design and the part where my voice cracked and I was like, was that the is that the one guy? I was thinking, I can't remember the actor's name, but it looked like the guy who played uh, Commander Asso from uh, all the Heisei movies, or most of them. Um, 
or as I heard one little twerp call it one time in a video, the high save series, which is kind of adorable and how stupid it is, but we don't need to talk about that. Um, so that's what I'll be doing. Instead of writing articles this year, I'm going to be uploading these things. So I'll just take it with my phone and I'll splice them together with the intro cards I made, and then I'll do one for every movie, not for every day. Uh, probably not going to be all that long, probably even shorter than this recording I'm doing right now, but hopefully you didn't hear that. Thanks, I'm trying to record something. But, uh, so yeah, that's that. And please remember to uh, hit me up on Instapals, uh, mash that like button for more hilarious bomb ass uh, kissing pranks, and educate yourself on chemtrails because the lizard people from the hollow earth are coming to the flat earth to conquer us with their Illuminati uh, harp uh, orgone therapy and they're going to mount a base so that they can launch an invasion on the giant planet within the hollow sun. Okay, and that's all I got, so bye.